Hello everyone, welcome to today's session. Today we are going to see what are homonyms. What are homonyms and homophones? What are these homonyms? Let's go and break its word and uh, look into them. What are these homophones? Homo means same and phone means voice. So homo, homophone, uh, they have similar pronunciation but different meaning. They sometimes have identical or different meaning as well. Take for example, ad, ad, it means an advertisement, add, it means an addition, but they pronounce same, take an ad and add. They pronounce same, but they have different meanings and different spelling. Look at the next example, beet and beet. Uh, beet is a beetroot, a vegetable, and beat means beating others, hitting. And uh, meat meaning flesh of an animal. Meat meaning meeting, coming together. So let's go and check out what are the other homophones in English language. So break and break. They, they pronounce same but they have different spelling. What is the first break? What is the meaning of first break? Break in a vehicle. And the next break means breaking somebody's leg or or breaking something. Take for example, when teaching when teaching my daughter how to drive, she told I told her if she didn't hit the brake in time. So this brake is brake of a vehicle. So this brake is breaking the car inside, breaking somebody's leg. Next one is cell and cell. This cell means prison or a small broom but this cell means selling something example if you sell drugs you'll be arrested and you will end up in a prison prison cell it can be otherwise called a cell and the next one is scent and scent they pronounce same they have different spelling take for example i won't spend a scent I won't spend one cent on a bottle of perfume until I know that I love that scent. So the scent meaning uh, we call it as paisa and in foreign language they, it means rupees and they have scent and this scent is a perfume and the next one is dye d-i-e meaning dyeing and dye it's a color dye dyeing your hair take for example if you accidentally drank a bottle of fabric dye color paint color you might die you may die you may in you may end your life next one is night and night this night is a warrior a soldier and night this night is night day night the night is one is on his way to his castle. Knight is a soldier or in olden days he fights or protects a gentleman who protects, uh, takes care of uh, the, the mansion. The next one is, but traveling at night is very dangerous. So though the knight is taking care of the entire castle, uh, I mean the man mansion, traveling at night is difficult. So not and not. This not means uh, fastening, fastening something, fastening a thread. This not means not, negative not. I do, I do not know how she learned to tie the knot, tie the knot to make the necklace. Next one is right, right, you know this, rights, somebody's uh, bond rights, uh, you have the right to speak, to speak everywhere, you have the right to speak whatever you want. And the next one is writing down, there is no right way to write a great novel. And the next one is C and C, you know the obvious difference. At, uh, at my beach house, I have a C. I love to wake up and see the sea. The next one is soul and soul. I need to get a new soul, put on my favorite 
pair of running shoes. So this sole is uh, the one you have something inside your shoes. That is the sole of a shoe. And the next one is jogging is good for my soul. Your inner being that is soul. Steel and steel. And this steel is stealing something. Someone who decides to steal a car has committed a crime. But auto parts are made of steel. So this steel is a metal and the first one is stealing. It's not a good virtue. And the next one is weather and weather. This weather refers to weather condition, the climatic change. And this is weather. It's kind of a proposition. Sorry, conjunction. I don't know whether to bring a jacket, a jacket or not. So this is the weather looks unpredictable today. The next one is homonyms. What is this homonym? Homonym is one form of a group of words that have the same spelling, same pronunciation, but different meaning. Let's go and check them out. Alight. So same spelling, but according to the context, it will differ. Check for example, alight the bus. So when I say alight the bus, it means get down the bus. Oh, uh, the entire house is alight, meaning on fire. The entire house is on fire. The next one is bear, an animal. Next one is bear with it, meaning you'll have to be patient. Carry with it, carry on. Uh, kindly bear this, meaning kindly carry this. Next one is address to speak or the location of somebody's house. Take for example, the principal has to address today, to speak today. The next one is, could you please give me your address? And uh, air, oxygen, and a lighting tune, air. They have aired the music, they have aired the program, meaning they have telecasted it. Current, up to date, and uh, flow of a water. Take for example, she has uh, uh, every details, she has every current details, meaning up to date details. And uh, today the current of the water is very heavy in the river, so do not go to the river, so meaning the flow of the water. Next, kind and kind. This is very obvious. Kind type and caring. She is very kind. What kind of letter is this? What type of letter is this? Next one, circular. Taking the form of a circle. And the next one is a store advertisement. Take for example, it is a circle. Circular motion. Circular form. And next one is a circular which is uh, given and passed out in the management for an advertisement or announcement. Next one is chow, a sharp jutted uh, object and the next one is a crying spring. Pound, a unit of weight and to beat. This pound means I want you must, if you are aware of a Shakespeare story, I need a pound of flesh, meaning a weight of flesh. And this, he pound on her, meaning to beat. Next one, a rose, get up, uh, and this one refers a flavor. And uh, for example, he rose up from the bed, and this one, he gave her a rose. Next one, well, in good health, and the next one is a source of the water. For example, we need to collect water from the well, meaning from the source. Tender, gentle, offer, money. Uh, she is very tender, meaning very gentle. Uh, she, uh, she has to tender it, meaning uh, offer money. And the next one is tire. To grow fatigued, to grow tired, and the next one is tire of a wheel. The tire has punctured. And the next one is rock, a music genre. She is rocking, rocking, meaning she is rocking in the